I'm the hottest round. I told y'all mother, y'all can't stop me now. Listen to me now. I'm lasting 20 rounds. And if you want me, then come on, get me now. Hey everyone, it's me, Psychedella Babe, and welcome back to my channel. Now, yesterday, you may remember, I did an unboxing of some Rotifers. Now, I've had quite a bit of feedback off this video, and I've had quite a few people asking me what Rotifers are and what their purpose in the tank are. So, I thought in this video, we'll go over a few things about them, and the footage that you're seeing is me target feeding my corals with the Rotifers, and, well, you'll see for yourself when you watch the video. Now, rotifers may not look like much, but trust me when I tell you that they really do pack a punch once they've been added to your fish tank. Now, these little microscopic beauties are a delicious food source for the smallest inhabitants of your aquarium. From your baby fish to your colonies of copepods, they are irreplaceable staples to keep on hand. Now, similar to the gut of humans, the health of your rotifers can determine the health of your entire aquarium. Now, rotifers are a particularly good food source due to the wide range of fish that enjoy them. Practically anything that can fit them in their mouth will eat them, including all your young and your baby fish and even your corals. In fact, rotifers are the best food source for your baby fish and larvae, especially if you've got young clownfish in your tank. Now, the problem with most foods is that they're simply too big to fit in their mouth. So that's, this is why rotifers are just so brilliant because they're so outrageously small and they're so easy to digest and they're just a nutritious food source for newly hatched fish. Now when it comes to your corals, rotifers are the quintessential food source for them. The right rotifers can give your coral a major boost in size and in growth. Now since they're so rich in crude fat and protein, rotifers are especially attracted to most corals so it's just a basic win-win situation now the spot where many reefers fall short is the diet they feed their rotifers no two rotifers will have the same nutritional value but you can be sure that a rotifer fed a diet of pea flour and yeast will not have the same nutritional value as a rotifer that's been fattened up on a diet of phytoplankton and other living foods you see, rotifers are a bit like delivery vehicles for nutrients. On their own, they aren't technically any good at all. And they're not nutritious. Because if you feed them nothing but nutritious, poor foods and dead supplements, they'll take on the nutrition of what they're actually eating. So basically, if you feed them something bursting with nutrients and energy, like say green phytoplankton, then both their growth and nutritional value will go through the roof. And that's when you start to see the enhanced growth and vitality inside your reef tank. Now, it also doesn't hurt to give them some nice healthy supplements from time to time to give them that little boost. Now, fatty acid supplements are perfect for making them even more nutritious. So when fish eat properly and they're fed proper nourished rotifiers, they will grow faster and they're more resistant to fatigue than those who eat nutrient poor rotifers. And at that point, I cannot stress enough, your rotifers are only as good as the food you feed them. Now, rotifers aren't just for feeding either. They, they, they are like copepods. Rotifers will thrive on detritus. They will eat dead bacteria. They eat algae and they also eat a number of things that are going on in and around your tank in fact these little creatures that are so microscopic small can eat particles up to 10 micrometers in size so considering the size of these little critters that is a whole lot of food that they're eating now like crustaceans rotifers contribute to the nutrient recycling for this reason they're used in fish tanks to help clean the water he also helped to prevent clouds of waste matter. So whether you're raising clownfish, seahorses, corals or shrimp, rotifers can and should be the backbone food of your entire habitat. From supporting growth to enriching the overall diet, quality rotifers should be on the top of your shopping list for a healthy and happy aquarium. So if you've ever thought, maybe I'll give them a try, please do. 
my corals absolutely adore them as you've seen in the video and they really can't get enough of them so there's a few little hints and a few tips about rotifers hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up if you're not subscribed to my channel make sure you hit the subscribe button make sure you hit that notification bell now if anybody else has got any questions for me make sure you drop me a comment below and if i find everyone's asking the same question i'll do another video about it so you're giving me a great excuse to come on here and talk to you all so from me psychedelic babe i hope you have a wonderful evening i hope you've enjoyed this video don't forget to like share subscribe and drop me a comment below i love you all thanks for watching bye